Ah, it brings back childhood, you know? Yes. I like how the character models, even though they're definitely improved, they're still so true to, you know, the characters we grew up that we love. I'll be honest, I did feel nostalgic playing it again, how it handled. Oh my god, I don't even know what to say. I mean, it was just bringing back memories of my childhood as I was playing it. I thought it was pretty dope. Uh, it was a throwback, it made me real nostalgic, you know, so. We've been playing Spyro games all our life. I played most of them. Oh, it's so amazing. I mean, I played the originals back home. I was born in 89. I'm definitely a 90s kid. Love classic 90s video games. There's just so much love put into this, and I'm happy for it. It's the first time I've ever tried Spyro, and it's a really, really good introduction point for me. So many familiar memories, like the na 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 na, -na guy. I don't know about enemies, but I'm really waiting to see Bianca's character model, because she was a babe. I loved her. I look forward to getting it. It is a great game. And it's great to see Spyro back in HD. My main dream for this generation was for Crash and Spyro to come back. They are clearly doing this game justice. I'm enjoying the controls. I love the more fluent animations, especially with the cutscenes. The music, yeah, I love the remakes of all, like the whole entire soundtrack. That's probably my favorite part. Combat felt very engaging, you know. It's more colorful now. It's more advanced. Um, Treetops was infuriating, just like it was when we played the originals. The jumping is still as challenging as it always has been, <laughs> and I love that. It, looks, it seems fast-paced, you know. I like it. It seems more interactive and all that, you know. I am really looking forward to like that second fight with the sorceress. Once this game launches, picking this up day one, physical and digitally.